All right, reverse. Oh, it's in reverse. What's up guys and welcome back to another video on the Autoblog YouTube channel. If you follow this channel on a regular basis, you'll know that a few years ago I did uh, some experiments on the cars that I had at the time. One of them was uh, putting the uh, transmission in reverse while driving. I did that in my 2015 Ford Fusion. That was an automatic transmission. Long story short, it turns out that newer cars, newer transmissions, they're pretty much dummy proof. I put it in reverse while driving 70 miles an hour and it basically just put the car in neutral so i had a lot of people tell me like mike you got to do this in an older car with a really old transmission and see what happens then so what i did was i bought a 1998 chevy prism and i did the exact same experiment in that car so then i had a lot of people tell me you got to do this in a manual transmission so what we have here today is my 1994 ford ranger with a manual transmission of course so as we can see here, we got three pedals, clutch, brake, and gas pedal, of course. And we've got a five-speed manual transmission with a shift knob that always uh, comes loose. <laughs> but yeah, we got first, second, third, fourth, fifth, and then we have reverse right there. So what I'm going to try to do in today's video, I'm going to get up to about 45, 50 miles an hour, and then I'm going to try to put this transmission in reverse and we're gonna see what happens. Will it even allow me to engage reverse? And what happens if it actually does go into reverse? Is the transmission completely gonna blow up? Am I gonna be able to release the clutch and do a standing rear wheel drive burnout going forward? I don't know. So what we have here is a road with uh, relatively low traffic. Obviously, I'm not gonna try this one out on the highway. We're just gonna get going, get up to speed and try to put it in reverse while we're driving. All right, so here we go. This is a completely non-scientific experiment, really. I mean, why would you accidentally put your transmission in reverse? Because see, you really wouldn't. I just want to find out what actually happens if that were to happen. Now, obviously, we know that we're going to hear some kind of screeching sound as soon as we try to put it in reverse. We'll try here. Yeah, see, we just got to use enough force, I guess. All right, so we're doing 45 miles an hour. Here we go. Ah, ah, okay. I, yeah. <laughs> it's not letting me do it, I guess. Thank God, but we're going to try it one more time. All right, so we're just going to get up to speed. And I'm going to use both arms. Try to get this thing in reverse. <laughs> abort mission, abort. There's a car. I wonder what people are thinking when they see two cameras with tripods on either side of the road. You know, it's not like it's a Top Gear episode we're taping here. Very low production quality. All right, here's a little incline, and this car has like four horsepower. It takes forever. All right, reverse. Oh, it's in reverse. driving <laughs> dude that was epic we gotta try it again we got it i was able to get it in reverse <sighs> i had to use a lot of power though while driving man we gotta do that again oof my heart's beating dude that's crazy all right, here we go again. <laughs> Dude, are you kidding me? 
this truck is awesome. This is the coolest vehicle I've ever owned in my life. I have a Ferrari F12 at home. I have an AMG, a truck. They're all dope in their own regards, but this thing is the coolest freaking vehicle I've ever owned. <laughs> Check it out, we'll do it again. the transmission no 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 it just it stalled what a trooper <laughs> it still works but you know what oh I thought it was in limp mode didn't have any power but now it's back <laughs> oh man no check engine light either. One more time. Fifty miles an hour. Here we go. the most epic what happens if video I've ever filmed on this channel <laughs> I mean this video has been absolutely nutty I think the only thing left that we haven't done yet and I just thought of this when I throw it in reverse I should keep my foot on the pedal until the vehicle starts going backwards I mean don't you guys agree I feel like I've, I've kind of like stopped before the car actually starts going backwards so that's what we're gonna do right now. All right, so here we go. This is the last uh, throw it in reverse and try to do a uh, burnout backwards while going forwards. We're going 50 miles an hour. <laughs> I've been shooting a video with my junky car, that's all. I set up a camera and then I drove by it. Okay, all right, that's cool. Yeah, because they kind of frown on, you know, well, you know the world we live in. Oh, I completely all understand. All the that goes on. Yes, sir. So I was I just understand. checking out, that's my guy down here. Well, oh, I think you better call Air Operations and have him check it out. I said, nah, I'll check him out. I'm going that way anyway. All so, right. <laughs> yeah, you Air don't look like a fucking Al Qaeda terrorist threat to me. So. <laughs> no, I'm not. All right, man. I'm not. I appreciate it, man. Hey, we'll see you I'm later. heading out. Thank you. <laughs> Call Air Patrol. Yeah, that's the last thing I need. <laughs> All we were doing, stupid experiments. You my trusted old hoop. The favorite car ever. This thing is awesome. So with that interesting ending, I think that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I sure did. I mean, I was completely shocked. I didn't know what was gonna happen. Of course, I was hoping that I would be able to go into reverse, but I didn't know. And if it did, you know, I figured the whole transmission would just blow. Because you're really forcing it into reverse when it's not supposed to be there. So yeah, it was 
absolutely hilarious. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a huge, huge thumbs up. Leave some suggestions for the next uh, crazy video in the uh, Danger Ranger from 94, what you guys want to see. And also remember to subscribe so you don't miss out on more funny videos like this. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.